since I am just a below the knee amputee, do I really need a handicap room? Because I look fine. Even though I look fine. There are still things I need. One of the reasons that I get a handicap room is because there is enough space to roll around. Because in order for me to get out of bed in the middle of the night without a leg, I use this chair that they provide to me that belongs to the desk. So I sit in it like this. This is so that I don't have to travel with a knee scooter or a wheelchair. Something else I love about handicap um, bathrooms is that you can roll under the sink in your wheelchair or your office chair. In this particular hotel room, there is the potty that is separate from the shower. So, in order to do that, I just have to roll. <laughs> One of the reasons that I get a handicap hotel room is because of this handheld shower head that goes along with this seat. Unfortunately, this time around, this wand does not work. So I had to call maintenance to try to fix it. They were not able to fix it. So I decided to take a shower instead, which sounds easy enough, but here's what I have to do in order to take a shower. I start from a seated position, take off my leg if it's not already off, and I have to very carefully, because this doesn't have brakes, hold on to the grab bars and put myself into the bathtub. I put my knee in first, and then I bring the other one in. Something else about this particular hotel room is the soap is mounted up there where I can't reach it if I'm sitting down here. And it is extremely dangerous for me to stand up in a tub full of water, slick, to try to get the soap. So I had housekeeping come bring me shampoo, conditioner, and soap so that I could take a bath. I had to wash my hair like this. Before you accept a hotel room that is handicapped, Make sure your wand works, okay? Because they might not have another room available and then you're stuck rolling around in the bathtub. In order to get out of the bathtub, remember the floor is wet, you are wet, there's soap everywhere because you're rinsing off in soapy water. So be very careful if you have to do this. I sit on the edge of the tub, very carefully put my hand on the edge, push off, keep a hold of something, several somethings, if you can, and sit down in the chair to dry off and put your leg on. <laughs> Need some help there? <laughs> there you go.